Anybody here ever seen uh, this unit? It's called the Acorn Stair Climber. Have <laughs> you seen this? Okay, if you haven't seen it, this is a product for seniors that are too stunned to get a bungalow. <laughs> and instead, you're supposed to hire this crew to come and bolt this track to your staircase wall. And then it's always the guy, women live like 30 years longer, it's always the guy. See him on the tube, he's just looking intrepid. Hey? <laughs> like a pirate on the high seas. <laughs> but the truth of it is, it's so slow. <laughs> and I think the more insidious thing, people forget old folks are people. It's not all fresh baked cookies and warm smiles. <laughs> They're volatile. Of course there's gonna be fights. And now when the guy loses, he doesn't have the option of stomping upstairs and slamming the door. <laughs> Instead, he's gotta sit there <laughs> and listen to her continue to win. <laughs> it's like the saddest thing in the world. <laughs> He's trying to hobble away. Oh, wow, he's turned his back. I guess the discussion must be over. This wasn't predictable anyway at all. Oh, 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 run away. That's your answer for everything. Run away. Off he goes. And now he's got to worry that she might go bounding up to the top and just wait for him up there. Oh, oh. He's got to pull some decoy thing. His only hope is maybe he can trip her on the way back down. She puts out a hip there. What do you call 911? I've fallen and I can't shut up. What do you say that, woman? Oh, that mm. So I made it. <laughs> I had to go through secondary like I do every time now because of that waiver. Thing. But I made it. I'm in Watertown, New York now, in the Walmart parking lot. It's, I'm tired. It's uh, it's almost two in the morning, October 25th now. So I'm gonna catch some sleep and uh, let's see. I got these nice shades <laughs> from Walmart. Aren't they cool? I don't know if you can even see them. I'm gonna go to sleep. In the Walmart store. Walmart shopping mall. <laughs> On my way south. So, 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 so. Gotta get rid of the, out of this shitty snow. Don't want any snow. Well, it looks like I'm heading into the next state. Just past Syracuse. And the next one is saying, uh, Scranton. Scranton. Yeah, we're going to be in Scranton pretty soon. I think that's in Pennsylvania. We're moving along. Weather's not too bad. There's a little bit of rain around Syracuse. Traffic was bogged up for some lame bullshit. Anyway, a couple of days ago, our pretty boy prime minister, for all those of you that give a shit, <laughs> Justin Trudeau, got re-elected, but not with all the popularity he did last time. Uh, definitely the best looking Prime Minister the Canada's ever had but he's uh, starting to lose his charm he got uh, a minority so he's gonna have uh, the PCs chasing after him trying to boot him out 
take over. Good thing, I guess, is the NDP will have a lot of uh, power, uh, I guess. Uh, they were really pushing for uh, national pharmacare, free pharmacare, free dental, eyeglasses, and everything. That's what they want to do, which is good for an old bastard like me, I guess, on a pension. Or if you're poor, poor, out of work or anything like that, can't afford the uh, drugs. We get free health care, but you got to pay for the drugs. <laughs> yeah. Government knows a good thing when they see it, I guess. Get their break from the, the drug dealers. But anyway, yeah. Uh, He might, he may lose his uh, position. They usually have within six months to a year and a half to get things. They, or they get uh, pushed out. Anyway, we'll wish him luck. This old man went through the same thing. When he was prime minister uh, back in the 70s. He was an ugly little bastard. But anyway, well, wish him all luck. I'm going to be down, hopefully, in the sunshine. <laughs> That's my two cents. Hey. Personally, I thought uh, the NDP were going to do a lot better. It's their leader. Uh, Really likable, solid, sincere, no bullshit. Answers questions when he's asked them. But um, he wears a turban and has a beard. And uh, you know, Canada Canadians, there's a lot of closet racists. He had a lot of great ideas and a lot of people liked him. But I guess when it came down to it, they couldn't seem to uh, wrap their head around the Prime Minister wearing a turban and having a beard. <laughs> maybe if he had shaved off the beard and took the turban off and got a haircut, maybe, uh, maybe he would have done better. Canadians are like that, you know, I find. They talk about, you know, loving everybody, but a lot of them deep down. <laughs> Closet racists. Me, yeah, I like them. Right now, I'm uh, behind this transport. He's clipping along right at 65 on the button. And I'm tucked in behind him. I'm, I'm sure I get three or four or extra miles from the gallon doing this. But I'm in no hurry. Rest area coming up. Eh, I'll just keep driving for a while. It's only uh, 1.30 in the afternoon. I'd let ask him say hello, but he's, he's sound asleep there in the back. Whoa. Hey, Cousin Bob, the Bushman. Hope you got enough smokes. <laughs> You gotta make that last uh, supply I brought you to you for uh, six months. <laughs> I don't think so.
So I made it to the Massanutan Mountain Resort in Virginia. It's October 26th. I didn't film anything on the way. I was driving mostly at night and there was a lot of rain. But isn't that a beautiful sight? Show you some pictures of the room. I'll be here for a few days. If you were going to try and put it in your phone, Alan. So I'm here to celebrate my sister's 75th birthday. Say hi, sis. Hi! I'm alive <laughs> and kicking! <laughs> So this is the inside of the uh, unit, I guess you call it, that my uh, sister rented for a couple of weeks in the, uh, I think they call it the regal area of Massanutan. And look at this October weather. Indian summer, I guess, in the Shenandoah Mountains. It's uh, what we call up north two semi detached houses, that's what it is. Two bedroom. Semi-detached condos, I think they call them down here. Now they want me to go over to the uh, resort pool and spa and what have you. So I guess I better get ready and go over. So this is the mass and not no look. We were here a couple of years ago in March, and this is what it looks like in October. All the colors. Short movie. I think it's recording. Yep. Hey, Papa or Daddy or hi, yeah. hi, Daddy. Hi, Daddy! Hi! <laughs> Look at you.